You have some wonderful credentials, including being a CPA, an MBA, and being president of a large company. Were these credentials helpful to you when you purchased your own business? Uh, very much. Uh, I think one of the things I've learned over the years is that for anybody to be successful in any role, you have to have ability to begin with, and then you need education and training and experience and probably most of all the willingness to do whatever the function is that you're going to take on. And my experience, my educational experience uh, certainly helped prepare me because it gave me an overview of what kinds of things happen in a business. Um, and I got some basic accounting skills, which are really critical to a business. That's probably the lifeblood of a business, making sure you have cash and that you know where the, how the cash is coming in and going out. Um, but the experience um, is invaluable. And uh, everybody's going to make mistakes in life and in a job. I, your employees are going to make mistakes. You can't expect them to be perfect. Those mistakes are going to cost you money, and you almost have to budget for that. I was able to make my mistakes on somebody else's dime, uh, which was probably good for me, maybe not so good for them, but that is part of the cost of doing business. And now you, as the owner of a business, are going to have to accept the fact that when you bring somebody in new, um, part of the cost of hiring a new employee and training them is that they're going to make mistakes that cost you money. You may as well budget for it, but I had the opportunity to make those mistakes before I bought a business, and that prevented me from making a lot of mistakes after I purchased the business.